Hello, I'm Alicia, aka Rhapsody, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing my February 2016 beauty haul. So this is all of the products I purchased in February um, combined into one haul, uh, except for um, those that I've done separate videos on um, from specific brands like a lot of the indie brands uh, like Geek Chic and Notoriously Morbid those I've done separately but this is you know I bought a few things from Sephora I bought hello Esther I bought a few things from eBay um, I bought a few things from All Cosmetics Wholesale and so I'm just gonna tell you about all of those in one great big haul right now so first I'm going to show you um, what I got from eBay this month um, eBay from eBay first I uh, I have been super into highlighters it was my obsession for the month and so um, I had read some stuff about City Colors highlighters. City Colors is a very affordable brand but they have um, a lot of um, really nice highlighters many of which are kind of dupes for uh, much more expensive brand highlighters and so I um, and so I decided I really wanted City Color um, White Pearl highlighter this is this is kind of a cream highlighter. Just like that. Now on the website this looked a whole lot bigger. Not that that's the seller's fault or anybody else, but it did look a whole lot bigger. Nonetheless, I think this was like $5.99. It was very inexpensive. And this is supposed to be like a dupe for uh, Becca's Pearl. And you can see it's very reflective. It's kind of like having white diamonds on your skin. So I picked that up from eBay. Also, um, in my fervor for highlighting, I uh, picked up this Sleek uh, palette. This is the Sleek Midas Touch highlighting palette. I have a separate video where I swatch this out and tell you and uh, and review it. I will link that down below. Should you be interested? But basically, the palette looks like this. Yes, that is a very deep blue highlight. And basically. With this palette, you get one cream and three powder highlights. I got this for $12.99 with free shipping from the UK. It took a couple weeks to get here. And you can see that you've got another kind of Becca Pearl dupe, which is really nice. I'm in love with this uh amazing blue highlight here. I kind of um, swatched over this uh, grayish kind of highlight, uh, cream highlight here. I'm not quite sure what to do with cream highlights, honestly. And then you have this sort of uh, peach highlight, which is also quite pretty. So that was another score on the eBay front. And the final thing that I purchased from eBay, I picked up a half a bottle of Lang Lancome Eau de Lingerie. I I can't speak French to save my life. Excuse me, but um, this is a scent that I had smelled in a in Ulta and really liked, but I did not want to pay to pay sixty dollars for the bottle, and I paid instead of sixty dollars for a full bottle, I paid five dollars for half a bottle, and it smells great. So another great deal on eBay and then um, at and of course on eBay I also got I think I got like 5% cash back through Ebates which is always cool I love Ebates um, I, I'm consistently getting like a $25 check um, just for cash back for my online because I, I shop online too much quite honestly and if you are not familiar with Ebates I'll have a link to that down below as well um, 
along with everything else. If you look in the info section down below, there's lots and lots of information. From Hotlook, which is another uh, of my favorites, uh, Hotlook is Nordstrom's discount site, and they have uh, basically um, you get on their email mailing list so that you get messages about what their sales are because their sales, they have like a hundred sales running at once, but they change. Um, each sale runs for like three days and then it's over. Uh, what's there is there. When it's sold out, it's gone. So, and um, all kinds of different brands, you know, really high end brands uh, quite often are there at super reduced prices. And you just grab what you can when it's there. And, um, but unfortunately, one of the downsides of Hotlook is it takes them like forever to ship. I was on the site looking for um, stuff to pick up for my husband for Valentine's Day. Uh, this was I, I made the purchase back in January. It didn't I didn't receive it until February. That's why it's in the February haul. And I found a couple of awesome pairs of socks for him. That's why I made I made a purchase at Hotlook. Um, including these um, just super cool mummy socks. I mean, how cool are those? But um, but they did wound up not arriving uh, until after Valentine's Day, which was really annoying. But while I was on the site, I did also um, snag Mary Luminizer, which is something I had been lusting after for a very long time. This is, of course, you know, one of the all-time great highlighters that everyone um, refers to. But I had not picked it up previously because it is $24, and that is a lot to pay for a single highlighter. However, um, at Hotlook, I snagged it for $12, so 50% off, and I thought that was a very good deal. And there it is in all its glory. Right, moving on um, from All Cosmetics Wholesale, which is another one of my favorite si online sites um, where you can pick up, as the website name suggests, lots of cosmetics at really discounted prices. I did place a couple of small orders over the course of the month, and I finally um, bit the bullet and for the longest time I had been wanting to get Sugar Pills Absinthe, which comes in this super cute little box. So I finally picked this up because and during one of uh, all cosmetic all cosmetics wholesales sales. So I think um, I got 30% off? I, I can't remember exactly how much it was. I think um, regularly the the pigment is $13 and I got it for $10. And the thing about All Cosmetics Wholesale is that the prices are reduced to begin with and then if you catch it, um, if you wait for the right sale, you can always get whatever you're interested in at a, an even more discounted price with uh, a discount code because they're always running sales on top of things. And I also picked up another um, clean color uh, lipstick set um, just because it was super cheap and I'm into funny colored lipsticks. Uh, these are I think four for $3.99 and it was during a sale so it was like 40% off so these were like 60 cents a piece. During, um, during the sale I also picked up a another LA Girl Flat Finish Pigment Gloss, which is basically their liquid lipstick. Um, this is in Secret, which is uh, kind of dark red, because I needed more reds to get um, some of my ombre looks going. I got uh, some, some Z Palette uh, magnets, because I needed those. And finally, um, there is a like factory blemish section of a of all cosmetics wholesale where things are super reduced um, because there's something wrong with it and what's wrong with it could be really horrendous or it could be something minor in this case what was wrong with it is that the color wasn't labeled so this is a lancome 
eyeshadow. Um, I don't know what the color name is, but it's a nice purple. And it's uh, and it only cost me like two or three bucks. From Sephora, I got just a couple of things. I really didn't want to spend a lot of money. However, I had uh, a few points to spend, and I discovered that you can't spend points on um, unless you purchase something. So I really needed a new moisturizer. So I picked up this Clinique um, moisturizer, which is very heavily recommended. Um, and it turns out that I don't like it, but it was only $5. I had a free shipping code, so um, for $5 I got this and was able to cash in 100 points and get this, which was the real reason for my order. This this is Smashbox's Photo Finish uh, Primer, which I wanted to try, and I think I like it all right. I'm running out of my other primer. Moving on, I got a couple of things from Wet n Wild um, during the past month. From Target, I picked up this Wet n Wild uh, Ombre Blush. This is in the shade in a Purple Haze. And, and I have been looking for a good purple blush um, for ages, and I really love this one. This one, um, you can tell it's already kind of well loved. I believe this was $5. Um, and it uh, it's very soft, uh, blends out quite nicely, and it's quite flattering, and I've um, been wearing it a lot. I'm very pleased with it. From Rite Aid, I picked up a couple of these. These are the new One Step Wonder Gel uh, nail polishes from Wet n Wild. These uh, retail at Rite Aid for $5. If you have the Plenty card, they're $4 because you get 20% off. And I had a couple of coupons for my mom. Thank you, mom. So these were $2 a piece for me um, to try out. And I just took off this one um, this morning. I must have worn it for at least two weeks. And it had just started to chip around the edges. I mean, it wore forever. So I wish that they had more interesting shades. But in terms of formula, I'm extremely impressed. And the other goodies that I wanted to show you in my February haul um, are just a few uh, little bits and pieces from Etsy. First, check this out. So, I realized that I really needed a Z palette, but I didn't want just a Z palette. A Z palette is so impersonal, right? Plus. I was reading reviews and everyone said they eventually they, they fall apart. I mean they're made of cardboard. Yeah. This is sturdy as hell. There's no cardboard involved. This is a Glam Tech palette. And it is customized. You you tell them what you tell her what design you want and it's etched into it. So, um, I believe this was $18 plus $4 shipping. Very affordable. I'm loving it. Um, you can have it customized with any design you want. Um, so, big fan of Glam Tech, which is a, a, a new find uh, on Etsy for me. And the other thing, the final thing I'm going to show you in this haul is something inside this palette. And what I have inside this palette at the top, I have my uh, Luxy Beauty, which I'm top and bottom are Luxy Beauty actually, and I will be doing a separate video on those. Um, on the side here and this one are Divina Cosmetics, and I'll be doing a separate video on those as well. I have some more that um, have overflowed the palette. I've got another palette coming, um, but these two right here. Okay, I was making a mess. I'm just going to make this more simple. This is Daydream and this is Next Level. Daydream. Look at the glow on that highlight. 
I told you I was obsessed with highlighters this month. And next level. Look at the violet sheen there. These were um, $10 a piece on Etsy. And as you can see, these are not small pans. All right, so um, that is my haul for February. I hope you enjoyed seeing uh, my loot, and I thank you for watching. Until next time, um, if you haven't already subscribed, please do, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.